And now, Policy Brief, how U.S. policy affects your world. U.S. President-elect Barack Obama, Vice President-elect Joseph Biden, and their families volunteered in the Washington area ahead of inauguration ceremonies this week in celebration of Martin Luther King Day. The goal was to make Dr. King's legacy of public service an even greater priority throughout American life. We made some level ground. An American civil rights leader and Nobel Prize recipient, Dr. King challenged his country to end racism, fight injustice, and eliminate poverty to, in his words, make America what it ought to be. I have a dream. My four little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream. Assassinated 40 years ago, leading a peaceful protest for workers' rights, his legacy is cherished. Though frequently jailed and threatened with violence, Dr. King led the civil rights movement to a series of landmark victories, including the enactment of the 1964 Civil Rights Act. Because Mr. Obama is an African-American like Dr. King, his election to the nation's highest office is also seen as part of the fulfillment of Dr. King's legacy. Change has come to America. That America strive to become a nation where people are judged by their character rather than the color of their skin. This year, the United States has this too to celebrate. I have a dream. That was Policy Brief, how U.S. policy affects your world.